So my name is Andreas, I'm 40 years old, Professor of Marketing and Communications and uh, currently I'm Director of ESCP Europe Business School Berlin. First of all, um, the traditional lecture, professor, student, top-down will be rather the exception. Obviously there will be a lot of things going on online in the digital sphere. The students will be active uh, co-producer of his or her course and uh, the professor will evolve from uh, being a lecturer towards being a coach, facilitator, trainer. It will be more about the development of skills than the transmission of knowledge. The business school of the future will become way more student-centric than it is now. Uh, since students will be considered as obviously future alumni, but also as future potential donors. So anything that will increase the attachment of uh, students towards their uh, business school, such as study trips, um, student societies, sports, any kind of events, uh, a very professional career service, will be very present in the business school of the future. So, why are these changes happening? Well, first of all, to get funds is more difficult nowadays. Especially in Europe, public funding is decreasing and therefore the fundraising from external corporations or from the aforementioned alumni will be vital. On top of it, the cost of doing a successful business school will increase because of higher expectations from international accreditation bodies such as AACSB or ICWIS and uh, international rankings such as the Financial Times ones. I'm convinced that the business schools will be expected uh, to take very strong stance on a variety of societal topics, uh, certainly triggered by the um, financial crisis of a couple of years ago, where a lot of blame was given to business schools of not uh, correctly educating uh, the businessmen and the women of the future. And therefore, topics such as sustainability, um, business ethics, uh, corporate social responsibility uh, will be very, very important in the future business school. And on top of all this, the competition is going to be fiercer, resulting from the digital evolution revolution. And this is why the community or the notion of community is so important. You need a functional, very dynamic, loyal community around major stakeholders, which is professors, academic, non-academic staff, uh, alumni, students, and any external uh, partner there is in the business school. Well, the digital might actually kill the business school. I'm, I'm, I'm just joking. It's not going to kill the business school, but uh, there will be major changes, obviously. Keywords will be MOOCs, box, artificial intelligence, blended learning. Many of the courses will have a significant share of digital content. The student will need to be persuaded why he or she actually needs to come to the campus. If it's possible to do the same online, uh, there will be uh, quite some attention. At the same time, I think uh, the building or the facilities will even become more important than they are now because students will need to uh, like coming to campus. And uh, this is only possible in very good, very comfortable facilities. So this is going to be very important. It's very exciting to be part of uh, this uh, business and uh, it's fun to participate in this evolution, revolution, uh, reinvention of the business school. So if you're interested in, in this topic more in detail, then there should be some reference here down in the comments section uh, with an article about uh, or dealing with all the things I just explained inside.